Number 10. Income-Based Fines In Finland, traffic fines are based on two factors, how severe the offense is and the driver's annual income. It is believed that the most expensive ticket ever given was to a wealthy businessman named Yossi Solanoya. He was fined 170,000 euros, which in today's standards is the equivalent to about 235,000 U.S. dollars. Number 9. Summer Olympic Warriors Finnish athletes have won more Summer Olympic medals per square capita than any other country in the world, at a rate of one medal per 18,000 citizens. They also have the most gold medals per capita, at a rate of one gold medal per 53,000 citizens. As of the last Summer Games in 2012, Finland has won a total of 302 medals, 101 of them being gold. Number 8. Finland's Wildlife Finland is about three times the size of Ohio and is heavily forested, containing nearly 200,000 lakes, numerous rivers, and vast areas of marshland. Off the southwest coast are the Olin Islands, which are heavily populated by people of Swedish descent. Pictures and words alone cannot do Finland's immense beauty justice. As the old saying goes, you gotta see it to believe it. Number 7. Least Corrupted Since 1998, Finland has been said to be the world's least corrupt country according to the yearly survey by the organization Transparency International. In April of 2003, Finland appointed its first female prime minister, making it the only country in Europe to have both a female president and prime minister. A short two months later, Yatimaki stepped down from the office when it was revealed that she had leaked classified information against the rival opponent in the election earlier that year. Shortly after, she was acquitted of all charges. Number 6. Father Christmas Most countries have some form or other of what we like to call Father Christmas or Santa Claus. Finland is the same way. They call him Yolpuki, which can also be translated to Yule Goat. It is said that he resides in a house built on top of the Arctic Circle in the northern province of Lapland. Finland's Yolpuki received more than 700,000 letters from children across the globe, according to a study by the Finnish Broadcasting Company in 2006. Number 5. Coffee Fanciers Do you think you like coffee? Chances are you don't drink 26 pounds or 12 kilograms of coffee annually. That's right. The Finns are the world's biggest drinkers of that black substance which some addicts believe fell from the heavens. That's three times more than the amount of coffee drank by a typical American, according to a 2008 study by Chartspin.com. The Finns will enjoy roughly 4.7 cups of coffee per day. That's consuming more on a daily basis than Americans, Canadians, and Russians put together. Number 4. Education Children living in Finland do not attend school until they are at least seven years of age. It's not mandatory for students to receive marks until they're in the eighth grade. Because of this, the country has gained a reputation for being quite relaxed when it comes to education. Teachers generally spend only four hours a day in the classroom and are paid to spend two hours a week creating lesson plans and assessing student progress. Number 3. The Polar Nights There's a reason Finland is often called the land of the midnight sun. It's because during the months of June and July, the sun shines all day and night. Not once does it rest and fade away below the horizon as we are so accustomed to. The exact opposite also occurs during midwinter. There are days in parts of northern Finland when the sun is barely visible. Everything is bathed in an eerie blue light, referred to as kamus. These events are called polar nights. Number 2. Chill out. The Finns take relaxation seriously. Of the 5 million citizens who reside in Finland, there are roughly 2 million saunas, 
giving the country about a two-to-one ratio of humans to saunas. Most Finns think of a sauna as a life necessity and not a luxury. It's also not uncommon for Finnish mothers to give birth in them. Hey, considering Finland has one of the highest life expectancies in the world, perhaps they're on to something. Number one, ice swimming. The Finns are known to love two extremes, freezing cold and bitter warm. Ice swimming is one of the most popular pastimes in the country. Both young and old participate in this activity so many others would look down upon as being foolish. Ice swimming is known as Avantaunti in Finland and Estonia, and there is an Antavunti society, and swimming holes are also maintained by other groups, such as the Finnish Skiing Association. Like these top 10 videos? Subscribe by clicking the annotation here and give our video a like. Have an idea for a future top 10? Leave a comment in the section below.